Hello everyone and welcome to this Aquas tutorial. In uh, this tutorial I'm going to be using Aquas 3 and I'm going to show you how to, uh, how the um, feature distance based tiling works in Aquas 1.3. Um, in this tutorial I have a very large water plane set up with nothing else um, in the scene uh, except for a directional light and a camera. And one thing that we had with Aquas in the past was that if you moved away from the water, um, if you moved very far away from the water, you saw visible tiling like this, where you can see that the texture repeats itself over and over again, which looks, which looks, doesn't look very pretty. Now in Aquas 1.3, we have uh, the distance based tiling feature, which is, um, pretty much aquas changing the tiling of the texture depending on uh, the on your distance to it and um, to do that we simply click aquas and we go down to the material settings at the bottom where it says medium tiling distance long tiling distance and distance tiling fade now I have these set to 10,000 now just so I could show you um, what it looks like when I move away now let's just quickly change this medium tiling distance to something like 500 and the long tiling distance to something like maybe 2000 and now if we move away from the water we see that we don't see this um, repetitive texture tiling instead everything stays uh, stays very natural so we can we can move away this plane is really large now it's uh, 426,000 uh, units. If we go back close, we see that um, we see the water in high detail, and if we move away, we have very natural look. That's still, if um, go back close, and if I set that back to 10,000 as it was before, just so you can see the difference see that when we move away it looks very unnatural <coughs> yeah that's pretty much it the um, oh yeah one last thing uh, if I set this to 500 and this to 2000 again uh, we can set the fade uh, which says at which point is the water supposed to transition or to blend the large tiling and the low tiling and um, the higher you make this value um, the more uh, sharp this uh, blending will become. If you leave it at something like 0 0.5, it's going to start blending between the, the tiling values very early on. And um, the values for this, um, f for the distance based tiling, usually dependent on um, what type of scene you have, how big it is, how what kind of look you have. Is it an RTS style game or is it a an FPS uh, style game where you can stand like high up on a mountain and look down on the water? Um, that kind of stuff. And yeah, that's, that's pretty much it for distance based tiling. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helps and if you have any questions please feel free to contact me or leave a post on the forum. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot for watching. Goodbye.